Hello viewers, in this video I'll show you how you can test your car battery at home without taking it to a shop. And if you find that your battery is low on charge, I'll show you a device that is able to test and charge your car battery. This device I have here is the Conway 3-in-1 battery tester and charger. To test a car battery, first connect the red clamp to the positive terminal of the battery and the black clamp to the negative terminal of the battery. The tool will get power from the car battery and power on. To use the tool is very simple. You have the escape button to go back, enter button right here, up select, down select, and the repair button to repair the car battery. Looking at the main menu, the first item is check battery. You want to select that, press enter. Next it will ask you if the battery is in vehicle or out of vehicle is in vehicle. Press down, press enter. Here I'll ask you if you want to do a battery test, crank test, or charging test. I want to do a battery test, press enter. Now it's asking you if the battery has any surface charge. What that means is if you drove the car around for like an hour, then the battery has been charged for a little bit. What you want to do is go in your vehicle, turn on the headlight, and leave it on for about 10 seconds and turn it off. Now if you have not driven the car, go ahead and press enter to continue. Next I'll ask you the type of battery it has. Now most vehicles will use a regular flooded battery. But you want to double check the type of battery you have because many modern day vehicle with auto start stop feature will use AGM batteries. But for this vehicle it's regular flooded, press enter. Next you need to enter the CCA or cold cranking amp number. This number is usually found on a sticker on your battery. Press enter. For this battery the cold cranking amp is 640. You can adjust it by pressing the up and down arrow. After you enter the CCA number, press enter. Now it's testing the battery. You want to pay attention to the SOH and SOC number. SOH is state of health of the battery. SOC is a state of charge. So the health of this battery is 94% and the charge is 65%. And on the right, it'll tell you the measured voltage. Right now it's 12.39 volt. And at the very bottom, it'll tell you if the battery is good or bad or if it needs recharging. Now with 65% charge, I'm gonna go ahead and charge this battery. So let me show you how to do that. When you're done with this test, you just go ahead and disconnect the clamps and the tool will power off. To use this to charge a battery, you will need to connect the AC power cord, which is included. Plug this end to the bottom of the tool and plug this to an outlet. With the power cable connected and the unit powered on, connect the red clamp to the positive terminal of the battery. Connect the black clamp to the negative terminal of the battery. Looking at the main menu, you want to scroll down to battery charge. Now press enter. This battery charger has a microprocessor inside. It will automatically calculate how much current it needs to charge a battery and it will constantly adjust the current so it does not do any damage to the battery. When you first start off, it might be four, five, six amps. After a couple hours, it might drop to two amps or one amp. When the battery is fully charged, it will go into trickle maintenance charge and the charging current will drop to 500, 300 or 200 milliamp. And that's one nice thing about this charger with a built-in microprocessor it will intelligently monitor the charging current and it won't overcharge or damage the battery. So it's been about five hours. As you can see, the charge is 100% now and the charging current dropped to 0.7 amp or 700 milliamp. So at this time you can stop the charging by pressing the escape button. If you want, you can test it again. Here it tells you the state of health is 96% and the state of charge is 98% and the battery is good. You can disconnect the clamps, unplug the power cable, go ahead and close the hood and you can start driving the car. As you can see by having a tester charger device like this at home, you can easily find out the condition of your battery and if it needs charging, you can charge it yourself. Now this tool retails for about $60, so it's not too expensive. If you want to pick one up, check out the link below. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching this video. To support this channel, remember to click on thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and turn on the notification bell so you get notified of new videos.